Do you need to replace the I.O. circuit board from your XPS 9315? Well, I'm going to show you how. Also, you can click the top right of the screen to find this part or tools or additional help on our website, including written step-by-step -step tutorials with detailed images. Now that that's out of the way, let's get started. Okay, first unscrew the bottom base cover. Note that these are the only screws that will require the Torx number no. 5 screwdriver. All other screws will need the Phillips number no. 0. Then you can use a plastic scribe to pry open and separate the bottom base cover. To prevent static discharge, I recommend disconnecting your battery before moving any further. I also recommend sorting out your screws as you take apart your laptop. It'll make it that much easier during reassembly. Next, disconnect the I.O. board cable, lifting from the outside of the connector as shown here. Then unsnap the locking tab and disconnect the cooling fan cable. Now unscrew and remove the cooling fan. Then slide out the speaker cable connector. Now unscrew and disconnect the I.O. circuit board cable. Now unsnap the locking tab and disconnect the power button cable. Now unscrew and lift up the right LCD hinge. Now unscrew and remove the I.O. circuit board. The reassembly of your laptop is as simple as following your steps in reverse. If you still need help, you can visit partspeople.com and view printable DIY instructions to help you along the way. We also have playlists of thousands of Dell tutorials for hundreds of different models, so keep checking back. Thanks for watching.